Hello YouTube, it's me, Shady Love, and I'm back. Um, and I'm going to do um, some scents from the Dora collection. Uh, their uh, seventh element collection. Um, and they're the imitation. They're doing imitation for uh, Coco Chanel, Coco Mademoiselle, and Coco Noir, and the Chanel number no. five. Um, from the, from, you know, from uh, Chanel. So these are your uh, imitation for your high end, um, higher end um, designer wear. So the first one I'm going to do for you is the Seventh Element Classy Damsel. Okay. Um, and that one is for your um, Coco Mademoiselle. So that's your invitation for your Coco Mademoiselle. Um, and those notes are, it's the Oriental Spicy, Coriander, Pomegranate Blossom, Mimosa, Clove, Orange Blossom, Sandalwood, and Vanilla. And um, they all come in just literally like the kind of like the same packaging, the same uh, bottle looking, give or take the top is white or the box is black or something like that. But this is your um, fifth element um, classy damsel by the Dora collection and then that's your imitation um, Coco Mademoiselle and we're going to get a, a gander of that and I do happen to have my fan right off over to here to the left of me <laughs> Smells very good. Um, this is a very warm and spicy. You could wear this in the summertime, but um, it's probably this is probably this was probably originally uh, probably a winter scent from Chanel because it's um, very spicy and warm. It's a it's a beautiful scented. Um, perfume. Let me work on my lighting, which is a natural lighting coming from the back side of my window. Anyway, this fifth um, element, uh, classy, classy damsel by the Dora Collection. Um, this is very a warm scent. Very, um, I would say it's a very, um, it's very uh, bright and spicy. Um, I feel like you will wear this more or less north towards the um, winter seasons, and it's they give you a very nice amount. It's a 3.3 .3 fluid ounce, and as I um, get through, uh, get near my uh, ending of my review, you'll see that um, all of the packaging on these are mostly the same because they're trying they're um, trying to focus on like doing like a Kind of like a classier packaging because they're doing like the Chanel scents, I think, because they're doing the imitation of the, you know, the Chanel scent. But anyway, I happen to have torn out from a magazine, um, the Coco Mademoiselle advertisement. <clears throat> and um, and right in right in the the flap here is that scent. So you know. I was all too uh, quick to, uh, and they do smell a lot alike. Actually, this one smells um, really, really spicy, probably because of the, um, you know, the glue here that they had to glue it with, and also um, just being the paper and the glues and the inks from the magazine, so probably changed the um, scent profile just a little bit. But you can tell that it's, you know, very uh, smells uh, similar. And it's a very uh, good smelling perfume just by um, testing this. But because I, I just had this on just a piece of cotton. And um, it's such a bright and um, warm and spicy scent. Um, yeah, this smells really, really, really good. They smell really similar. Um, this one from, the, from this paper... Um, 
this is smelling muskier um this is musky warm and but it's really bright you know bright and warm uh, for the winter time and this is more like real smoky to me okay and that's yes that's your seventh element classy damsel and that's your imitation that's your imitation from the Dora collection for your uh, Coco Mademoiselle okay the next one I have here is um, the, just the seventh element um, and the seventh element is your imitation for the um, for your Chanel number no. five okay so yeah that's your um, imitation for your Coco I mean for your uh, Chanel number no. five um, and these um, scents that I got from my local Phallus Paradas were only $1.99 for a 3.3 fluid ounce bottle of perfume. So in this one, these are still in the cellophane. I had opened that one other one up, but this one's still in the cellophane. Okay. Seventh element. So as you can see, the packaging in the boxes, they look much the same. The bottle looks much the same. Well, the same. It just has like seventh element instead of seventh element. Classy damsel. Okay. And this one's for your Chanel number no. five. And those notes are floral jasmine, neroli, rose, sandalwood, yinglang, and vanilla. And that's from your Dora collection doing their imitation of a Chanel number no. five. Okay, so let us take a and I have had Chanel number no. five many a times. Um, in my lifetime so I know what Chanel number no. five smells like and um, I think I do still have a little bit of the uh, powder in my drawer the little powder that they have with the little puff um, that they give out yeah that smells now this does smell like Chanel number no. five um, I want to say it kind of smells exactly like Chanel number no. five. Like it smells strong. Um, it smells very perfumey, very jasminey, um, very floral, very um, very very per, uh, all season perfumey type of a scent. Very soft and powdery. Yeah, this smells exactly. If you want Chanel, Chanel number no. five. Um, that that um, classic Chanel smell that you get um, seventh element from the Dora collection is definitely your scent because it smells exactly like Chanel number no. five exactly there's not I don't I can't yeah this is yeah Chanel number no. five is what this smells like exactly like Chanel number no. five seventh element by the Dora collection it smells exactly like Chanel number no. five and I'm so happy I, I buy I bought this because um and I'm smelling it right now with you all and I'm so happy that I bought this because of the simple fact that I love Chanel that's one of my scents is Chanel um so yeah I'm gonna have to go back and get another one because they had like a, quite a few of these. So, I, and for $1.99, I can back that up easily. Now, the next one I want to um, get in for you guys is the um, uh, Seventh Element Classy, and that's your um, imitation for your Coconut. Okay, and um, those notes are warm and spicy grapefruit. Um, Calabrian, bergamot, rose, narcissus, geranium leaf, jasmine, tonk bean, sandalwood, vanilla, patchouli, white musk, frankincense. Okay. 
and I'm spelling this one with you guys for the first time. Okay, seventh element classy. So you know that's for your uh, your Chanel Coconut. Okay, so let's go. The bottle, the fluid, as you can tell, the fluids are just like a little bit lighter and darker. This this one has like a darker fluid to it, more orangey. Okay, so I'm gonna shake that up. And I'm not sure if I've, I don't think I've smelled Coco Noir before, but um, Chanel has a lot of scents. So, and they, you know, have a lot of scents bouncing off of these ones right here also, especially the one that's bouncing off of the Chanel, so. Okay, this is very spicy, very leafy, green, leafy, like really leafy, like you ground up some leaves and, you know, put some of the dirt in there also and some of the flowers and you just kind of really ground up, whatever you use, you just ground it up until it's, it was just really natural. Um... Like you really didn't add water to it. You know, it's just that concentrated, really spicy, spicy, leafy, floral, uh, fruity, you know, kind of a, not fruity and a sense of uh, uh, bath, body spray or anything like that, but like kind of like a, like fruity as in the hull, the, 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 the you know what I mean? the peelings and the, the rind and things of like that so this is a very strong and spicy scent um and it may smell exactly like the coco noir because it smells like a very serious warm uh perfume i imagine it probably stays on a very long time because most of the Dora collection stay on a really good while. Most of their perfumes, I haven't had any to give me any problem. So that's why I'm going to say most because I don't have all of the scents. But I do have quite a few. Um, and this one is very warm and spicy and very, very winter. Very, very winter. Um, I, I would say it's a very beautiful scent. It's a very beautiful, serious scent. Um... And I, I, I feel like it's an acquired scent also because everyone will not like this scent, but it's a very strong, beautiful perfume. Um, and that will be it for you, uh, for me today, you guys. Um, I wanted to come in um, and do these three scents. Definitely the um, Seventh Element by the Dora Collection, um, which we have the Seventh Element, the Seventh e uh, Element Classy, Class, Classy Damso, and the Seventh Element classy okay so i wanted to do these for you guys um so why they're 199 at fattest paradas i don't know if you have fattest paradas um because online they're costing like ten dollars so um if you can't find them cheaper go out and do that if not um they still are cheaper than your designer sense than your original prices that you're going to pay at the mall and they smell really good the Dora collection is one collection that has the great longevity and great projection um, with their perfumes, you guys. Like, subscribe, comment. Um, I may come back in with a few other scents or just to come back in just to sort of uh, chit-chat a little bit on today. Um, I haven't been in for a second, you guys. I have some scents um, also in this box that I do have to uh, get out to you all i do have some sense in this box right here that i have been picking up so you know shady love do uh collect her scents so i may come in with another scent today you guys so um like subscribe comment as i said and um more to come stay tuned